what I found is that uh, Amazon uh, is uh, asking more questions about dynamic programming and uh, trees is what I found. Right. So the second question that was asked is completely based on tree and uh, binary search. Uh, actually, uh, uh, curriculum as well. Like there's a good roadmap on how, what what data structure will be thought after this and all the data structures that are necessary for the place. So don't ignore anything. It's just that few companies will have uh, inclination towards something. <laughs>
लाइक मतलब काफी कंपनीज में वी अप्लाइड लाइक एवरीवन विल अप्लाई इवन आई अप्लाइड एवरीवन विल बी अप्लाइंग एंड दे वोंट गेट द रिजल्ट्स दे वोंट गेट शॉर्टलिस्टेड मतलब काफी रिजेक्शन फेस करना पड़ता है लेकिन बहुत लाइक लेट मी टेल यू बहुत कंपनी बहुत अपॉर्चुनिटीज है कभी जस्ट गिव इट जस्ट वर्क इट विद अ पॉजिटिव मेंटल एटीट्यूड ठीक है सो जस्ट कीप ऑन वर्किंग कीप ऑन बिल्डिंग योरसेल्फ while you are applying just keep on applying so at some point you will get like you won't get uh, like i know many people who are not even uh, from good branch but they have succeeded right so it's yeah. it's all about having a ment- positive mental attitude yeah. okay so you mentioned code forces and code chef so aisa kabhi nahi hua ki code forces pe achhi rank nahi aa rahi and you feel frustrated ah uh, okay uh, <clears throat> nice question but uh, so i have seen uh, like i would discuss this with one of my friend uh, at some point uh, where a few people make a fake like they are already a good uh, at good level and they wanted to make a fake account just to show uh, show that they are exponentially increasing every day but what i feel is that uh, competitive programming mein ya kai bhi like you you your rating increases it falls your rating increases it falls in that's how it is supposed to be that's how the data will be will be authentic to you right so the, uh, so So I said to him that scars, like any scars, are most beautiful things, right? So if you if you see that there are some downfalls, and that's the most beautiful thing that you you went down and then you came back up, right? So obviously many times happen. I've given the contest, but I just solved one question and I just I uh, went back. But that should not stop you, right? That should not say that I'm going to make another account. This is not going to get you anything. That's not going to happen. Just make it, make it, make it, make it, make it, right? uh I, I, overall you will be in long term you will be seeing that you have improved you have improved, improved a lot yeah okay mm-hmm. uh so can you share the selection process for amazon yeah sure uh, so <clears throat> basically the first step uh, includes uh, where you will be registering for a particular job opportunity right so there will be job opportunities that will open uh, in if your uh, if your amazon comes to your campus like you can register directly to your college or else you can go to the amazon's career page and you can go to the job opportunities where you can search sd or sd in testing or something whichever uh, profile will fit you right so at that point you can register and you need to upload your resume as well right and uh, once you upload your resume uh, what will happen is that uh, he after some time they'll be verifying reviewing your resume and all those things right so and then you'll if at all your your uh, your resume is shortlisted for the test you'll be getting a link for the uh, online test right okay so uh, so that test usually for all the companies something i'm in general ki they will be having some two to three questions of uh, coding like dsa questions which need to be solved in a certain time that is one and a half hour or two hours based on the company right but for amazon uh, let me tell you about the uh, test uh, there are five sections for section is the debugging section there will be some certain number of uh, certain code that is given you need to debug the problem in it they will be give, they will be giving you the logic what this code does and it is not performing well you need to find out what is the problem that is the first uh, section the second section is uh, uh, second section is a place where you will be asked about aptitude right and third section mein uh, mcq sir dsa ka dsa oops object oriented programming ka fourth section mein you have the coding two questions are uh, one is based on the heaps and other is based on dynamic programming easy questions easy to medium level questions both of them they could be solved okay. if at all you have a presence of mind right and uh, the uh, last section is the proficiency fit round where uh, like amazon has 14 leadership principles and based on those principles uh, they just check key for a particular given situation are you reacting the way uh, in which uh, which it is supposed to be like you are supposed to be reacting based on the leadership principles these are the five rounds of amazon uh, like main hi bolunga ki test bahut mushkil hai like a test kafi easy hai like if at all you have you went to good preparation or you if at all you followed a proper road map and you prepared for the test it is uh, easy i can say that it is between easy to medium it's all about time like a time mein karna hai to ye hua online coding online test ke baad did competitive coding help you at all in this amazon's resume shortlisting and everything right right so competitive programming is is a different uh, thing from dsa right so competitive programming will enable you to think in a way uh, like think in a way to solve a problem right it's a, it's more about solving a problem and coding it in, uh, in, in using a programming language right it will improve your cognitive skills it will improve how you will be looking at a problem how you can how many perspectives you can look into a problem how to build a better 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 solution right 
तो ऐसा होता है कि कभी कभी पार्शल करेक्ट आंसर आता है एंड यू ऑप्टिमाइज इट इवन फर्दर बाय थिंकिंग बाय ब्रेन स्टॉमिंग अलोट सो इन दिस ब्रेन स्टॉमिंग एंड दिस ट्विस्ट एंड ट्वेल्व यू विल बी लर्निंग लॉट ऑफ थिंग्स राइट योर योर माइंड विल बी गेटिंग एडेप्टेड टू द न्यू क्वेश्चंस राइट तो इसमें लाइक यू विल बी गेटिंग फ्लुएंट विद द थिंकिंग एंड द कंप्यूटर कोडिंग एज वेल यू यू बिल्ड अ सॉल्यूशन एंड देन यू कोड इट डाउन राइट लेकिन डीएसएम ऐसा होता है कि यू विल बी प्रोवाइड लाइक यू how uh, certain data structures and algorithms which are pretty defined it's just that ki the difference is that ki jo bhi tum practice karte ho those questions are uh, just dsa questions mein pata kaise karna lekin online test mein thoda bahut they just manipulate it in a way ki uh, you 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 need to figure out ki what question is it and in that in that uh, in that particular aspect computer program will help you like the way it has uh, change your mind will help you you figure out ki what type of data structure i'll be using here what type of algorithm i'll be putting here how to break down this problem this thinking will be improved in the competitive program yeah. okay okay That's thank you yeah so uh, what happened after the test you mentioned that first there was resume shortlisting after that there was a test right what so after, after there's a test there'll be uh, so based on the marks you gained like overall marks based on the uh, all the sections right so i think there's individual cut off for each section and also um, for the whole marks you'll be calculated and you'll be uh given the interview opportunity like you'll be take uh, you you need to give some interviews to the amazon right so usually the first round is definitely dsa so i'm i'm telling this again and again dsa is the most important thing like that contribute to that will contribute uh, to your placement around 80% okay the resume and all the other things are secondary but the primary thing is the dsa you can get it just all over there uh so the every every company like even google google will take just uh, three rounds of dsa right microsoft will take two rounds of dsa that's it and amazon also takes two rounds of dsa and microsoft doesn't even like i I've, i've seen many people who for whom microsoft doesn't even take a project round right so uh so the in the in amazon there are uh, there are two rounds of dsa one each hour right and after that so this thing happened in my internship session so they'll be asking few basic questions and uh, in the interview uh, your the interview what happened is that uh, they were they asked me certain about basic data structures like do you know tree do you know uh, do you know this do you know heap such questions they were asked and they uh, they went through the resume and they asked ki what about this project can you tell me about this project a little in that way they explain, they asked few questions and after that there were two questions uh, based on a dsa that was asked and uh, there's another question that's a follow up question on the second question that was asked and all these things got wrapped up in 60 minutes and then i was moved to the second round right okay. so in that way in that way after selection i uh, i got i got an internship of offer and okay well are there any particular topics that were asked the most in the interviews right to me to be honest uh, guys uh, for the, for any kind of preparation like if you know you are registering for a particular company so what i suggest is that you can go through the uh, gfg archives of that particular company so what happens is that uh, so many so interview will be taken for many people and usually each company will have a kind of uh, one data structure as their favorite or one type of question that are as their favorite right so those type of, like the people who has already given the interview they will be uh, posting it anonymously in gfg archives so you can just go up and google up and you can just find gfg archives amazon and you will be finding all the interview experience of the other people who has already given the interview and what i found is that uh, amazon uh, is uh, asking more questions about dynamic programming and uh, trees is what i found right so the second question that was asked is completely based on tree and uh, binary search right so uh, so what i have i have seen that trees were mostly focused but uh, don't limit yourself to any particular data structure so just by looking at this i want you guys to prepare uh, in a really good manner and then just go to the company specific uh, and just you can go to the company specific uh, uh, preparation in gfg archives right and you yeah, you can see even acquire jobs uh, acquire jobs uh, uh, curriculum as well like there's a good road map on how, what what data structure will be taught after this and all the data structures that are necessary for the place so don't ignore anything it's just that few companies will have uh, inclination towards some that's it. okay uh so uh, would you mind sharing the strategy for preparing for uh, amazon okay cool uh so uh, strategy uh, strategy ka first step will be uh strategy ka first step will be making the resume okay that's the first step according to me right so uh, while making resume uh, so let me give you a few tips about making a resume how how i build my resume right so initially resume kaise banao ki uh, you mention only the important details 
not very redundant detail so it should not exceed one page more than one page i'll give it i told this to many people like uh, resume ka page like resume ka size should not exceed one more than one page you have more than one page like like even the interviewer is not going to review your resume for 10 to 15 minutes he'll just go through it uh, for 15 to 20 seconds and he'll just just you uh, as a whole right so the most important thing is that and the resume uh, like you can go to nova resume and all the other websites as well and even acquire job is posting uh, like sessions on building resume right so you can you can go through them and uh, you can see you can find a lot of templates in the internet you can just uh, put your details in it so usme uh, the most important um, section of the resume is the projects is what i feel okay so there are generally uh, two projects on a resume mere hisab se right so i put two projects in my uh, resume uh, doesn't matter like uh, initially bahut chota projects ho sakta hai you can later improve like resume ko constantly improve karna zaruri hai okay aise nahi ki ek hi resume hamesha leke jao so projects mein like the questions asked in the project uh, in the interview is also uh, is also based on projects ki why did you use this text tag why not this database why uh, why sql why not no sql so these type of questions uh, mostly will be asked in the interview based on the project ki tumne why why did you build this project using uh, this particular data structure or this particular text tag uh, how how do you do it without this aise aise questions puche gaye ठीक है तो जनरल डिस्कशन होगा प्रोजेक्ट्स के बारे में होगा ही हमेशा मतलब इवन इन द डीएस राउंड इवन फॉर मी इट वाज लास्ट फॉर फ्यू मिनट्स राइट या तो वैसे ही होने वाला है तो प्रोजेक्ट्स का अच्छी तरह से लिखना कंसाइज वे में मतलब ज्यादा बड़ा नहीं बस टू द पॉइंट लिखना हर चीज बहुत सारे रिटेंडेंट अचीवमेंट्स होते हैं अचीवमेंट का एक सेक्शन होता है जिसमें बहुत ज्यादा रिटेंडेंट चीजें मत लिखना जस्ट राइट द थिंग्स व्हिच आर रिलेवेंट टू द पर्टिकुलर जॉब ऐसे मत लिखो कि आई एम अ हेड बॉय ऑफ स्कूल ऐसे ऐसे कोई पॉइंट नहीं है लाइक आई हैव सीन मेनी पीपल राइटिंग दैट राइट एंड स्किल्स करके एक सेक्शन होता है वेयर यू विल बी लर्निंग यू विल बी राइटिंग ऑल द लैंग्वेजेस यू नो ऑल द थिंग्स लाइक मैं पर्सनली सी सी प्लस प्लस जावा राइट आई आई एम वर्क इन पाइथन बिकॉज़ ऑफ द मशीन लर्निंग प्रोजेक्ट जब मैं सेल्फ ड्राइविंग कर तो जो भी है लाइक फेक मत कर रेज्यूमे कुछ भी लाइक यू शुड नॉट फेक एनीथिंग इन द रेज्यूमे क्योंकि इंटरव्यूअर तो तुमसे ज्यादा uh experience that he'll be he'll be knowing more a lot of things than you like he can easily guess ki tumhe aata nahi but you have faked it in the resume right don't fake it for fake anything in the resume that's the most negative thing uh, you can face in the interview okay so don't do that and uh, so these are the tips about resume this is the first step how did you make sure or like build a resume like how did you make sure that you are focusing on competitive programming you are focusing on dsa as well as these extra skills like machine learning you mentioned right so machine learning is uh, i learned it when i'm building a project of my uh, self driving car right so at that point i uh, i learned it so i put it on the resume like i even have the github links you can you can even put github links in the uh, resume as well so yeah it's about that ki uh, you should know ki kaun sa section mein kya rakhna chahiye jaise ki achievements mein you can put ki course chef mein itna rank aa gaya course mein itna rank aa gaya that will reflect reflect ki you have done competitive programming right एंड ऑलरेडी ऑनलाइन टेस्ट क्लियर करके आओ तो ये सब आता ही है प्रोजेक्ट्स में तुम वो चीज नोट करोगे जो जो प्रोजेक्ट बनाए और स्किल्स में नोट करना कि मुझे ये चीज जो कॉन्वर्सेशन यू डू नेटवर्क हो गया राइट अगर फ्रंट एंड काम किया तो फ्रंट एंड भी लिख सकते हो आप फ्रंट एंड बैक एंड तो लाइक सेक्शंस बेस्ड पे तुम्हें डिवीजन आना चाहिए प्रॉपर्ली सो यू कैन यू कैन गेट हेल्प ऑनलाइन फॉर दैट ओके सो आफ्टर रिज्यूमे व्हाट व्हाट एल्स डू यू थिंक इज इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर क्रैकिंग द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग आई विल कीप ऑन टेलिंग इट्स द डीएसए तो डीएसए ऐसे नहीं कि तुम रैंडमली पढ़ने लगोगे लाइक एक प्रॉपर वे होना चाहिए उसके लिए लाइक 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 स्टार्टिंग में लाइक आई आई वेंट टू लीड कोर लीड कोर में वी हैव ऑल द लाइक एवरीथिंग सेट अप इन अ वे राइट सो पहले लाइक यू विल बी यू विल बी लर्निंग डीएसए राइट सो बेस्ड ऑन बेस्ड ऑन द थिंग्स फ्रॉम सिंपल टू कॉम्प्लेक्स डीएसए यू विल बी गोइंग लाइक फर्स्ट इनिशियली यू विल बी लर्निंग व्हाट इज link first you will be working with arrays and then you'll go to linked list and then you'll go to algorithms such as sorting binary search these are the initial algorithms you'll be working on right to so, proper plan ke sath jana padega isme uske baad tum thoda intermediate like stacks queues uh, ye sab data structures mein jaoge and advanced uh, advanced mein you'll be having something like uh, graphs and uh, dynamic programming ye sab right to so, proper way mein agar achhi tarah se dsa ko uh, karoge like you need to uh, spend some time with the theory as well and then you keep on solving lot of questions so that your mind will get habituated with the theory varna bhul jaoge right so practice okay. sabse zyada important hai dsa ke liye right and uh, proper way mein karna bhi bahut important hai theek hai 
तो ये दो चीज है लाइक रिज्यूमे एंड द डीएसए व्हिच हेल्प मी गेट इनटू द इनटू इनटू द कंपनी या थैंक यू सो मच आई होप यू ऑल एंजॉयड द वीडियो प्लीज लाइक सब्सक्राइब एंड कमेंट कमेंट एंड लेट अस नो व्हाट पार्ट ऑफ इंटरव्यू इंस्पायर्ड यू द मोस्ट थैंक यू एंड हैव अ गुड डे